If you want to play at 1440p resolution and you do not want to build a PC yourself, this video is going to be for you. I will show you 5 different systems for 5 different budgets if you want a nice 1440p gaming experience and I will also tell you the estimated average FPS at 1440p for each system, that way you know what you are buying. However, I want to say that most of these deals come from the Cyber Week deals, so maybe when you're watching this, some of these systems are more expensive and you will have have them down below in the video description so i recommend you checking the prices by the time that you're watching this but if you want to buy right now for the holidays i really believe that these systems are going to be amazing choices for the price that being said let's start with the first PC and the cheapest one is the SkyTech Gaming Nebula from Amazon. This one is a thousand dollars right now and it comes with the Ryzen 5 5600X alongside the NVIDIA RTX 4060 Ti. Then you get one terabyte of MEME SSD and 16 gigs of RAM. The RTX 4060 Ti is very capable of 1440p resolution but it's not going to be the best one out there because of the VRAM. If you are new to PCs, VRAM will make the textures look better and this helps with the visuals especially on the latest AAA titles that are hard to run because these are the type of games that require more VRAM. However, if you want to play easier to run titles, you can expect really high FPS even with this system with the RTX 4060 Ti. On a 15 game average at 1440p, the 4060 Ti was able to average 78 FPS, meaning that you will have a 60 plus FPS on average experience in most games on high to ultra settings. And on this test, high demanding games were tested. So if you want a starting point for 1440p and you want really nice performance for the price, this one for thousand dollars is a great option. If you have a higher budget than that, then for 1460 bucks, you can get the Eclipse Lite from the SkyTech website. This one comes with the i5-12400F, which has really similar performance compared to the Ryzen 5 5600X I've mentioned before. But here you get the RTX 4070, which is a much better 1440p GPU than the RTX 4060 Ti. It has 4 gigs of extra VRAM which is going to be helpful once again on those latest AAA titles on ultra settings and not only that but the RTX 4070 is about 30% faster than the RTX 4060 Ti in terms of performance. On that same 15 game average that I've mentioned before, the RTX 4070 was able to average over 100 FPS so this one is a much better option if you want the best 1440p gaming experience. You can turn up the settings all the way to ultra and you will have no issues with any game. However, with the next one we have a much better option for the price and it's actually the same price as the Eclipse Lite but you will get better performance and let me explain why. Here you get the i7 13700K, 16 gigs of DDR5 memory instead of DDR4 and you get the 4060 Ti but the main upgrade here that you need to make is the GPU. Go to customize and buy and change it to the RTX 4070 or the RTX 4070 Ti. Right now let's talk about the 4070 and I will talk about the 4070 Ti in a second. If you make the upgrade to the the RTX 4070, the total price is supposed to be 1620 bucks. But there's a coupon code for Cyber Week that gives you a 10% off. So the total price will be 1457 bucks after the promo code is applied. That one will be in the video description. Now, let me explain why this is a much better option than the last one. Overall, you get similar components in 16 gigs of RAM, one terabyte of SSD, and the RTX 4070, which is going to give you the same gaming performance. But here you get the i7. 13700K which is a much faster option than the i5-12400F for both gaming and content creation and if you play CPU demanding titles or esports games this will give you much higher FPS especially if you play on performance mode. So the fact that you can get this PC for the same price it's crazy to me and in my opinion this one is the best value gaming PC of this video and I would only go with the SkyTech system if the 45L is not on sale anymore when you're watching this video. Video. Also, I have a full review talking about this system. Well, it's actually the Omen 40L, but it has the same specifications and I run benchmarks as well there. So if you want to see how this one exactly performs, you will have that video in the top right of the screen. And then the other upgrade you can make is the RTX 4070 Ti, which is about 24% faster than the RTX 4070 in terms of gaming performance. And this is the current GPU I have on my system. In my opinion, this one is one of the best 1440p GPUs out there. There's no game that you can't run on ultra settings, even the most high demanding titles out there today. And I believe that after the 4070 Ti, the next level of GPUs are more for 4K resolution than they are for 1440p. If you make this upgrade and you apply the 
promo code and also if this PC is on a discount, you save $740 on your order and the total price will be $1700, which is an amazing price for the i7-13700K and the RTX 4070 Ti for a pre-built PC. So this Omen 45L with the discount plus the promo code is my favorite in terms of price to performance on this video. So if you're going to get a PC for your holidays and you see this one on this discount, buy it as soon as possible because I've never seen a deal like this from these 45Ls and I actually mean it. And then I also added one extra bonus PC if you have, and this one is the iBuy Power Y40 from Amazon. This one has the Ryzen 9 7900X, 32 gigs of DDR5 memory, and the RX 7900XTX. This is more of a 4K gaming PC than a 1440p one, but if you have more than $2,000 and you will eventually upgrade to 4K down the line, but you have a 1440p monitor right now, I think this one is an amazing choice for 2300 bucks. It is expensive, but on a 16M average at 1440p, was able to average over 180 FPS being the second best GPU on the market. So in my opinion it's an overkill for 1440p but as I said before if you have the budget to and you will actually upgrade to 4k at some point consider buying this one. And if you have different budgets let's say you have less than a thousand dollars or maybe more than 2300 bucks and you want to consider playing at 1080p or maybe 4k resolution. Recently I've made a video on the best pro build PCs of the month for every budget and every resolution. You will have that one in the top right of the screen as well with the 40L.